We are in the midst of one of the worst hunger crises in 40 years. 811 million people around the world are going hungry every night. Today, I'm chatting with T. Van Wong, the United Church Program Coordinator for Sustainable Development and Humanitarian Response, about how your generosity helps our United Church to respond to emergencies, including the current hunger crisis. T. Van, I'm really glad to be with you today. Thanks, Alexa. I'm really happy to be here today, too. Can you tell me how Mission and Service and our emergency response efforts have been helping both uh, here in Canada and around the world. So Mission and Service is supporting global partners in their response to food insecurity in their communities. When a hurricane hits Cuba or the super typhoon hits the Philippines, partners mobilize quickly to respond in the communities with food, hygiene kits, psychosocial support and shelter. So partners are best placed to respond uh, to and understand the needs of the community the best. Mm -hmm. um, so this not quite emergency response, but through mission and service as well, and through our membership with the Canadian Food Grains Bank and the Manitoba Council for International Cooperation, partners are doing the long-term work to address uh, food insecurity and hunger in their communities. Uh, for example, through conservation agriculture and agroecology. Uh, the National Council of Churches of Kenya are providing um, conservation agriculture trainings to smallholder farmers, particularly women farmers, and connecting them to more experienced um, women farmers that provides mentorship and support. They are also linking farmers to markets so that they can sell what they grow at a fair price. The impact of that is that farmers can uh, earn income to support their children's education and other household needs and improve their family's nutrition with um, Zimbabwe Council of Churches. They've been able to um, address gender-based violence within their communities. So um, issues such as early child marriages are prevented. So because of food um, security, people are able to farm, able to earn income um, so that they don't have to send their girl children for early marriages because they can't afford to feed them anymore. That's a significant impact. That, uh, that folks over here can help by, uh, by donating through mission and service. I'm um, amazed at how when we all pull together in one part of the world, we can affect change um, globally. Your gift for mission and service will help address both the immediate and long-term emergency response efforts.